Museum, it's, uh, it's buzzing. It's really buzzing. Um, I think we've got a good art history, which uh, everybody's interested in art should know about, starting from way, way back. It's not something that just fell out of the sky. There are men and women who started creating modern art from the 60s, and uh, it's gone down in history. It's given young people a foundation. Um, the issues which come up in the, in the school curriculum about Zimbabwean art, so it's good to, to understand it. And then, because we've been training people for a long time since independence, we've got a good grounding of uh, young people who've had a formal uh, training, as opposed to the older generation who just taught themselves and shared skills. And this is now paying off because we've got young people who are making waves, not only in Zim, but in the region and on the continent and globally. So I think the state of art is really exceptional. And it's, it's probably exceptional because of some of the difficulties that we've experienced in the last few years and our, where people have had to dig very deep and very creatively to be able to overcome obstacles and lack of. And this has resulted in uh, an incredibly resourceful and uh, resilient art that makes use of everything. So we're not spoiled by any means, but because of that, we're able to transcend and transform.